All right, boys, we only have a couple more golden ticket drops the rest of the year, and this one is actually a really good drop. We got two quarterbacks in it. We're going to be showing them both off. We're going to be in the first gameplay today is going to be Ryan Shazier. I'm very excited for this one. An out-of-position card, you guys know he got a little piece in his ultimate legend card, and that out-of-position quarterback was very, very good and very fun. The golden ticket's going to be the same, but if you guys enjoy gameplays like this, make sure that like and hit that subscribe. We're going to be doing them all for the rest of Madden 23, and then obviously when Madden 24 comes, you're going to want to be subscribed for those. But I also will be streaming on Twitch after I post the Mahomes gameplay too, so come check out the Twitch stream. But other than that, let's get into the gameplay. Before we start today's video, I wanted to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, MuttPacks.com. You can click the link down below and open exciting packs, win tons of coins, and withdraw your account right away. You could use promo code CHU for 15% off. Lastly, when you sign up down below, you can get a free 10,000 coin pack as well. All right, so there he is, 99 speed base. So I know the Easter strat card is like glitching right now after they nerfed the plus seven speed. A lot of people are trying to put it back in. So you don't need the speed boost on him right now. He's going to be 99 for you base. He has amazing stats, 95 plus in all the short accuracy, the medium accuracy and the deep. You'll be fine there. I know some people might like worry if it's not 99. You'll be perfectly fine right there. He also has great throw under pressure, throw in the run. Obviously, that really won't matter because we're using that fearless anyways but the abilities are really good his two zero ap's are gunslinger and Howard master and then obviously we're going to put pass lead to lead on and also fearless to build that quad sack the god sack whatever you want to call it but like i said very fun card that i loved the ul card it was a very well it was really good until they nerfed the ap and then you couldn't really use them anymore but now we get a card that's meta again He's not too expensive right now. It's still very early, so I overspent on him a little bit, but this should be a fun gameplay. Let's get into the game. All right, so Ryan Shay's here. I did just unlock my Cooper Cup as well, and Kyle Pitts is probably going to be our main target in this video. So we have a lot of new weapons to uh, throw to with Ryan Shay's here. It looks like we're playing a pretty good team. That Lamar, obviously one of the best quarterbacks in the game. The one thing is, is we know Shay's here against Slinger 3. Somebody has already had this card in the block. They've been waving around the block for a while now. The thing is, is he's basically another Lamar Jackson right in the game. That's what everyone going to kind of compare him to he doesn't get every team can but he might be a little bit more fun because he's out of position right all right all right we see some man coverage already so we have a couple routes we could do for that but i i'm first game with cooper cup by the way too and we have lyle collins in the backfield i for, for, forgot to put my donovan people's jones in we have a lot of new cards on the team though and i think we're gonna have cooper cup wide open already and you guys can see that beautiful throw already man that slinger three is really nice all right so we're gonna try to open it up a little bit he almost got home on that blitz right there actually it wasn't even a blitz it was a four man rush but with the obviously being a two-man high safety there's only so many plays i can call against that we're gonna do our best against it but we're gonna motion cooper cup let's see and look at mark bavaro baby yeah that short release is really nice obviously i'm coming from michael vick so it's a little bit slower but it's still really good all right so he's still in man coverage we're gonna try to run a bomb right now we need colin johnson basically to go off if colin johnson doesn't go off this is not gonna work at all we need him to beat that press and just get wide open and no he's dropping a safety up top and we're gonna throw this over right there that julius pepper six foot seven is not gonna save him there an underrated card i know a lot of people always ask me for like budget beast he's not a budget beast but he's definitely an underrated card that mark bavaro ultimate he's 99 in every single stat he has been amazing and i'm a browns theme team guy on my other uh on my other team and basically he gets browns and we just got donovan people's jones as well so we have two 99s now but Look at Shay's ear, man. That man coverage, hopefully that just forced him out of the man so he could run a couple different plays in the next drive, but that was what perfect drive. What, four for four, 75 yards and a touchdown? Doesn't get much better than that. Me, honestly, I feel like I've been having a lot more fun on Madden lately. I feel like this is the most content we've ever gotten this late in the year. The mold breakers, too, on top of the golden tickets have been really fun, but it looks like he's going to be throwing it right into that flat right away. That Joey Porter with universal coverage, free card, by the way, just a legend on the team. There we go. There we go. Now we got him over to the tight, so we're going to see a little bit. I, I'm... I was going to be ready for the trap right there, but it looks like he is not going to be running the ball, so we can actually spread out our line and guess pass right here, and we need to pick up. We know exactly what play most people run right here. Is he going to still throw this? Oh, man, that's the one thing that's kind of a, you know, a negative with Julius Peppers is when you over-pursue, he is so slow to turn. That would have been a pick with literally any other guard. I'm actually running the same play. Actually, I just messed up. He keeps motioning the running back over to like, uh, pick up the block a little bit or the blitz up a little bit more, but... I don't know what's happening right now. I'm lagging. I'm stuttering. Well, let's get my stuff together here. Need a pick or something, man. I'm blitzing everybody this time. We we have not blitzed all five yet. He's going to bring that guy up to block again. Let's send the crib. Hopefully, we can get enough pressure. He's going to throw over the middle. Nope, he has that guy, but here comes a big crucial fourth down. He did bring out his second X factor. Now, he has Gus the Bus and Flash, and he quick snapped me. I was not ready for the quick snap. All right, well, 
All right, it's been like an eight play drive to be fair. And he just crossed, he's not even actually across the 50. It's been like an eight play drive. So pretty long defensive play here or drive here. So we did get into another third and nine, but I am actually going to blitz this time. A lot of people and there we go, boys. So now we have him at a fourth and nine. I think we're in a really good spot here to kind of get a stop finally. He's bringing that guy into block. We need something. Come on, boys. I am only going to send that guy on the left side. So probably not going to be much of a pass rush here. I kind of actually just messed up. I messed up bad on this one, boys. Yeah, I messed up. Hopefully nothing crazy happens. Actually, we're going to get a stop. Finally, we get a stop, man. I, that was like like 12 plays of, of defense right there. He is in dollar now, but I'm not too sure if he's blitzing or not. So we're going to actually run our blitz pickup and see if it works. There we go. It takes a little bit, obviously. And I think he actually, is, yeah, he is blitzing. Okay, thank God we did that. And look who's going to be wide open. Ryan Shazier, Slinger 3, we all know how good it is, man. You can blitz all you want. We're going to dominate. This release is always going to be tough. We'll say Spinner is pretty tough to score on in the red zone. That's about it. That's like, I would say, the only place that I struggle a little bit in. And he's also not showing blitz every single time. You can see his slots backed up on the left, but he could still blitz him. And just in case, we're going to ID him. And he is blitzing him. See? I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. And look who's going to be wide open again, man. Mark Bavaro, he went from a man blitz in the first one to a man. Or he went from a man zone in the first drive to a man blitz in the second. Ryan Shazier, no matter what, is going to dominate. And no, he did not quit the game. I think this guy is trolling me, though. He did. I, I had to call three timeouts. He was manually chewing every single play. Basically meaning he would sit at the line until one second. So I had to call timeouts so he would actually speed up and play the game a little bit. But yeah, and he just paused it and waited all the way down to. I don't know what he, why. Maybe he recognizes my name or something. I don't know. But we're looking to, hey, hopefully we get another stop. I think we're in a good spot nonetheless because our offense cannot be stopped at the current moment. So I'm okay even if he does repeat with the touchdown right here. And he's running the tight still. Come on, man. We got KOs everywhere. I genuinely don't know if this guy knows that you could block your running back from the back and it would still be the exact same. But he is sending him on routes too. And right when I said that, I thought he was blocking his running back every single time. He is going to whip it right into the hard flat where we got our guy, Isaiah Palomao. We don't blitz our corners nearly as much as a normal dollar player. See, the problem is I do want to go for a big touchdown throw right here. But if he's blitzing us, we won't really have time to make a deep throw. Even with Slinger 3, one of the best, if not the best deep releases in the game, it's going to be super tough. And yeah, he is sending the curb right here, I believe. Can we snap this ball? There we go. Yep, he sent all five. And I think we actually are still going to get it. That deep release is butter, man. I Maybe I underestimated it because normally I can't throw deep bombs like that against Spinner with Slinger 1. But... With Slinger 3, you can do it. That's why Ryan Shazier might be on a lot more people's teams than Vic. All right, let's go get another stop, man. We've been dominant on all facets of the game so far. And man, we're going to continue. Continue dominating. He does that literally every single play. Every single play. That's another thing, too, that ruins your offense, if you guys do not know. Keeping the running back in the backfield. Now I'm never scared of you running the ball. I can guess pass every single play, and that helps the blitz as well. So that's why no one ever motions their running back out and don't know why this guy's doing it. All right, let's score another touchdown real quick, and then we'll we'll just shoo this game on now. This happens all the time. I'm not going to show me, you know, scoring 70 points on a guy, you know. You know, we got to keep our keep his dignity alive, I guess I could say, for a little bit here. But Mark Bavaro, baby, beautiful. I've actually been having a lot of fun playing against man coverage lately because I feel like I've learned a lot more routes, and this is going to be our first incompletion. Oh, man, our first incompletion, man, of the game. I did not want that to happen at all. Hey, we're calculating the bomb once again. We know exactly what he's running. We got that Omaha activated as well. And look who's going to be wide open, boys. Look at it. Cooper Cup, brand new addition on the team. Not enough burst for the end zone, but man, we get to chew a little bit more of that clock, though. All right, now we're in empty. We got the clock moving a little bit. Let's see if we can get a nice little scrambling touchdown to top this game on off. Could have probably had better running stick there, but at least we get to chew a little clock. I'm doing it again. We are doing it again, and we have no stick at all right now on our quarterback. Literally none. All right, we need to get a touchdown here, boys. Get a touchdown. Third and seven, Mark Bavaro. I'm looking for you, baby. And this is going to be risky, especially with KOs. No, it's not, man. One of the best tight ends in the game, Mark Bavaro, carrying in this gameplay as well. Shazier has four touchdowns, one incompletion all game. GG's. All right, boys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Ryan Shazier, that was probably one of the better gameplays we've had yet. That guy stuck in the same defense the entire game. I had to go ahead and chew that entire game out. He waited all the way to the end, calling timeouts. You guys know how it goes. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Check out that Mahomes, and check out the live stream as well, and I'll see you guys there. Peace out, boys.